The most important thing about setting a mood in a horror movie is to write scary music. We used John Carpenter's 1978 film as our creative foundation. Carpenter made some of my favorite films, and it was nerve-wracking to go in and pitch to one of your idols. His cell phone goes off while we're talking to him, and it's the theme from Halloween, and that's when I realized where I am and who I'm talking to. Original Halloween basically had a bunch of equipment and one guy. In this score, you have a bunch of equipment and three guys, so it's three times the score. <laughs> I got this idea for the Halloween main theme from my father, and he taught me 5-4 time. And so I sat down at the piano, and I just came up with a little riff. So that 5-4 time, and then moving down half steps. In the new Halloween, we made it as scary as we could. We knew we wanted to use the themes from the right. first movie. So before we even got started, we organized how we were going to arrange it. We have the original score, which was done in 1978. So what we're doing is building on that. The original was done with just my dad working with synthesizers and a piano. So the way that we're doing pays homage to the original and it keeps the feel. I don't think you can have a real Halloween movie without my dad. Cody's more precise on the keyboard than I am. He knows what's going on. Kids in my class knew who my dad is, and they said, you got to play the theme for me. So I've been playing that all my life. <laughs> basically just track the score out. It, it's a feel situation, improvisational situation. When he gets into his element, that's the most fun for me. He's been waiting for me. building with brand new sounds, brand new techniques. So I do the experimenting on my own and then present sounds that I think John might like. So sampling, old synths, and then John can play them on the keyboard. And get approximate sounds of what I dealt with. So that's Daniel's magic. He's the sound man in this whole thing. We would start and then suddenly five hours would have gone by, and it was kind of a stream of consciousness to work with John, who created the original, and then carry that on to work with David. It's really been a great experience for us. The sound of Halloween is so iconic. The three of them combined to create a, a once-in-a-lifetime Carpenter score for us. All right. Yes. 